today we are on a job right now and apparently there's been a lot of invasive ducks around guys you know what we're talking about we're talking about the muscovy ducks all right there's some actually back over there i don't know if you can see them it's the white and black looking ducks sometimes they have red stuff on their face well these ducks guys have been out here and they've been pooping everywhere and they've been kind of just hanging out claiming territory that really doesn't belong to them and the land owner wants us to come out here and do duck removal so that's why we invited lolly she's here we're gonna go over there and see if we can see any of these massive invasive ducks let's go check it out what a lot of people don't know is these ducks will actually defecate and potentially carry bacteria all in their environment so right here guys you can see all these duck tracks right here and we're gonna just throw a little bit of bait see if we can lure any ducks and what are these birds those are the ibises right there those are actually native species but look there's some look, there's some ducks right there yeah, yeah yeah there's some ducks and then there's actually a big one a big one coming out right there look at that ducks are everywhere and they're so fat look at them guys they're like turkeys they're like turkeys wow so guys comment down below a duck trap that you guys want to see us use we could use the air rifle but that might be a little chaotic guys to be honest with you. oh my gosh what is it like big whining man look at that what one moment wait 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 oh my gosh what do you see i think that's that's their nest you found a nest yeah no way look, where those these eggs oh, oh my gosh that is a nest oh my gosh that's how they lay eggs here yeah but wait do you think that's a duck Egg or... um yeah i would you say so? so i mean i don't think those little birds right there laid those eggs <laughs> guys we just found a duck nest look at that there's one there's two there's three four, iguana man they're five, they're warm six. actually yeah those ducks were probably they're just so nesting warm. on them hey good job Ali. you found the nest do you think we can take them? We are doing duck removal, so this would be part of, of that, because of that job. Because they hatch this and then, yeah. You know what would right. be interesting, Lolly? What? what if we did a catch cleaning cook on duck eggs? Okay, I'm down. Yeah? Okay, let's do yeah? it. Yeah? It's going to be kind of weird. Have you tried one before? No, I've never had a duck egg. I had an iguana egg before. I had a chicken egg. I even had a fish egg, some caviar, but I've never had a duck egg. Let's try. Oh, my God. I'm so yeah. I never did a catch clean and cook on duck eggs, and this is gonna be my first time doing it. So, Lolly, grab those gosh, eggs. You got the eggs? Gosh, I'm excited. I'm so hungry. So, we're gonna go ahead and put them in the bag. This is so crazy. Of course, we have the sun starting to set as well, guys. So, this is gonna be the perfect time and place for us to do our catch clean and cook on the duck eggs that we found. Okay, the water's starting to boil. We're gonna go ahead and add the duck eggs. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and let them do their thing. We'll see you guys back here in about 20 minutes. It's so huge. Oh, oh my. <laughs> what the heck? It pop, did you catch that? One okay, of the okay. one of the eggs. One oh the my egg gosh! Pop. What on what earth? What is in there? I don't know. Everybody, guys, we have no idea what's going on, but the eggs are just popping in there like firecrackers. Oh, those eggs look weird. But I am kind of hungry, so Me too. let's let it do its thing. All right, let's not rush them. All right. Yeah, I think we have about ten more minutes. Yeah. There's one sinking. One sinking. You think they're bad? The bad news is. At this point, we're not quite sure what kind of eggs these are, guys. First, we thought they were duck eggs. But as you can see, that does not look like... There is something literally inside of that egg that I think we cooked, y'all. There's a mystery inside that shell. That's good. Oh. Open it. Wow. Uh. Now, here's, here, now, here's the thing. There's no way I can eat this whole thing. You what? You can. Yes, you can. Of course you can. Wow, look at that. Yeah, right. Because we only took... Oh, wow, look at that. I'm not going to lie, though. It does smell like straight-up chicken, though. I'm not going to lie. Tastes like... Smells like chicken? Yeah. It yeah, it smells like chicken. A piece, of, a piece of roasted chicken or something like that. Tastes good, yeah. It's good when you eat it with a little Ooh. pinch of salt. 
to be honest. It's a very strong chickeny egg smell. We have a knife. Get a close up of this. We're gonna go ahead and see. Oh, look at that. This one right here is mostly yolk. But look, right over here, there's a... That's what you're gonna eat, Reg. Iguana man, look at this. Oh, That's what I ate a while ago. My, oh my goodness, guys. There is another baby duck in there. Hey, that's what I ate a while ago. <sighs> okay, I was hoping that this one wouldn't have a baby duck in there. Check what? that out, guys. You guys are seeing it right there. We found the duck eggs. We cooked them. We want to do a catch, clean, and cook. Had no idea that they were fertilized duck embryos. If I would have known that, I probably would have just left them be. But since we already harvested them, since we already cooked them, only one thing left to do, guys. It's time to try a fertilized duck embryo. Iguana man, nothing to waste. Okay, let's get right into it, all right? Okay. So as you guys can see, I'm going to just go ahead and take him out of there. And you can see that there is, in fact, a beak in there, guys. And a head in there, guys. All right, you know what? I don't know if I should just get it over with and just pop the whole thing in my mouth. There's feather in the whole thing. The whole thing? You sure? Yeah. Okay, that's enough. That's a lot of salt. Okay. All right, guys. So I've eaten a lot of weird things in my life, but this right here is, has to be the most bizarre thing ever, guys. There's legit a fertilized duck embryo in these duck eggs, and I cannot believe I'm about to try this right here. All right, guys. It is the moment of truth. The Iguana Man is going to eat a fertilized duck embryo. You guys are seeing it right there. Oh, God. I absolutely horrendous looking guys there's just a the thought of this but you know what i harvested it i'm not gonna let it go to waste you can actually see the feather fur right actually there the beak is the the most tasty one the beak that tastes so good that, that, the, that, beak. the beak and the head guys it is legit guys it is legit a fertilized duck embryo lolly in order for me to eat it would you be able to eat a piece of it real quick oh yeah so easy actually i'm so hungry but you know what iguana man the the best part of that is the beak the head and the brain inside. Oh my god, they so good. Uh, You're just gonna eat. I'm gonna eat this. I'm just gonna pretend this is a chicken nugget. I want you to eat it first just to give me the green light, all right? Hey, yeah. you saw me a while ago. I ate the whole one. Yeah, I seen that. I seen that. But just to reassure, look, check her out. Check her out. She, she just ate it. Nice and good. It's good. What does it taste like again? Chicken. All right, guys. Here goes nothing, guys. I'm just gonna pretend this Ooh, is a why chicken. Why so good? Premise. Premise. You can do this. Do you guys yeah. believe in me? Team Iguana Man. Comment down below. <laughs> Alright guys, here it's it so goes. Good. Here it goes, guys. Beak first. The beak. Show show yeah. Bite the beak, yes. Gosh. All right, so it's kind of a good thing you guys didn't see that. Okay, it doesn't taste bad. It just has a really weird kind of odor in your mouth when you're when you're when you're crunching it. All right, uh, let me try a piece of the. All right, you know what? Just take the beak. No, it's no, good I'm going for it. I'm going for it, guys. In life, you if you try something and you fail, you dust yourself off and you try again. Some salt. Some put some salt on it. Let me get this sprite ready, and we're just gonna you put it down do it. the hatch, right? Do Chewing it was a horrible idea. Yeah. All right, ready, set, go. Here we go. Here we go. You can do it. Swallow it. Swallow it. For one million dollars. Woo! How does it taste? Oh my god. How does it taste? It tastes champion. Okay. Champion the iguana man. <laughs> champion, champion, okay. champion. You're the best. It tasted good. It just had like a very farmy taste in it. That was it. And the texture in it. it yeah, it just had a very farmy kind of like it just had a very like like gamey taste to it a little bit very like i'm not used to a taste like that guys look look close up close up he's crying <laughs> okay i want to try i really want to try the yolk though all right the yolk the yolk tastes good i really want to try the yolk all right guys so that yolk actually looks like something i'm familiar with 
And guys, I'm not doubting that it's good. I'm not doubting that it's good, guys. It's just something I'm not really used to, all right? Yeah. It, it, it's just kind of gamey tasting, all right? Mm -hmm. Let's try the yolk. It's good. The yolk right? is better. It's good, yeah. It, it tastes like a chicken yolk. It's very salty, but it does have a very, it has a gamey taste to it. Yeah. It has a gamey taste. It doesn't, it, it tastes like a chicken egg. It tastes like a piece of chicken, but it has like, it tastes like a farm, kind of. You know what I'm saying? What do you mean farm? Like, it, it just has a, to me, it has a gamey taste. It has a very unique taste only specifically to this. It has a very unique taste that I'm just really not used to. I do respect it though, because I eat a lot of weird stuff. I've eaten pasta, I've eaten uh, iguanas, obviously, iguana eggs, and I've seen people like fail at those challenges. Mm -hmm. But, you know, I wanted to taste it for the second time because I wanted to, to give it a chance and to respect it, even if I don't like it. Excuse me. Oh, well, that was a good it's a delicacy. It is a delicacy. Yeah. So, so my final verdict is, if I was to get used to it, eating duck eggs, mm -hmm. fertilized duck eggs, mm -hmm. I can definitely get used to it. Balut. It's called balut. Just can you say balut? Ba 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 balut. balut. Yes. Get... Yeah, balut. Yeah. What, fertilized duck eggs, balut. Whatever you want to call it. If I was to eat more of it, then obviously I would get used to it. But since this is my first time trying it, mm -hmm. the the maybe it's the thought of eating what it is. And maybe it's it's that that taste and that 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 taste that when I'm, it's just going in the back of my throat, going up my nose, and I, it's like a, it's like it just consumes me. But with that being said, it's definitely edible. It definitely doesn't it doesn't taste no sour or nasty or rotten. It just has like a very kind of farmy taste to it. So that's gonna be it. There's one more piece. Did oh. you did you feel the beak in it when you're chewing it? And did you feel the feathers? You, you see, farmy. It actually it's you know what. It's actually smelling and tasting better the more I'm used to it. I think it's, well, it's an acquired taste for sure because it's a delicacy, you know, like like durian too. Like, uh, I want to challenge you sometime with a durian fruit. Well, I just ate this piece and I will say that the gamey taste is, is, is getting more tolerable for me. Mm -hmm. it's, I can tolerate it more. So, but, but the first time that maybe that whole entire baby duck in my mouth wasn't the best idea. Um, Lali, what? you're my guest. Thank you so much for coming Thank out here. Thank you. Thank you for, for welcoming me again. Thank you so much for coming out here, guys. Guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, like, comment, and subscribe channel. What is the channel called, Lali? Yes, guys. It's Lali Amante. L-A-L-L-Y. A-M-A-N-T-E. Lali Amante. We're gonna I'm put, on Instagram too, guys. We're going to put it right here. We're also going to put it in the description yeah. down below. So make sure and check her out. Actually, I want to apologize. I should tell you to taste the yolk first. Then the, the, the chick, the duck embryo. That's Isn't what I was it? expecting to see. I wasn't expecting to see uh, a, a baby little ducky <laughs> inside there. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Mmm. So you know that just tastes like a regular egg. This one. Yeah, that mm -hmm. just tastes like a regular egg.